Hello Libra. So this video is for Libra Sun, though it may also resonate with Libra Moon and Libra Rising. Please make sure to check out your Sun, your Moon, and your Rising Sign video as you may resonate more fully with one of those more than the other. Depending on which part of your personality or persona you are acting from at any given time. Also check out Apocalyptic Tarot. When that channel monetizes, I will be moving this channel over there. So please make sure to subscribe there so that you will still be in the loop. If you'd like to leave a donation for my channel, there will be a link in the description box below. Without further ado, just remember this may be about you or it may be about someone around you. Whether it resonates with you, I guess matters if it was you or if it's somebody that is around you and whether you know what's going on around you fully, right? So what do I have for you? The very first card out is danger. This could be danger as it relates to a romance, danger as it relates to a creative project, danger as it relates to a child. For most of you, this is a child settlement from a health issue or a work issue, okay? It says that you're afraid to make a choice because you got wish fulfillment out of this situation. You got wish fulfillment by transforming it. You had internal conflict potentially here um, as it related to a health issue or a work issue. So you may have engaged in some sort of um, sexual activity. With a one on one partner. In order to recover empathy. There could have still been a transformation though to your money or your self-worth. So you're trying to be strong. It says that because of a belief system, you made a change legally and were inspired by family. When the truth came out, or maybe they told you you needed to tell the truth, but instead you recovered empathy. So twisting the story around so that people would feel sorry for you rather than telling the truth that the truth came out is most likely what this is. All right, so. Let's just see what comes out with the tarot for Libra. All right, oops, I forgot to put these up. I already got a card for you though. You have the new beginning card. This could be um, emotional fulfillment as well or feeling overwhelmed by emotion. Libra, please. What's going on this week for Libra? There was some sort of new beginning offer that was made here. Could involve um, a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn.
It looks like you made a new beginning offer or somebody made you a new beginning offer and became single. So this is one of those things where it's like, oh yeah, we're going to, we're going to have this new beginning together and then you walk away or they walk away. Again, so far it's looking like it would be an earth sign, but it can be any sign really. It looks for it looks like to me you got a new beginning and you offered to become single actually. Maybe because of a belief system. About a deceptive choice. So you got a new beginning and you offered to become single from a commitment or because of a belief system and made a deceitful choice. To wait on your ships to come in from a victory legally. And I'm just going to say before I go any further in the reading, this is legal deception. And there's the deception card again. So we've got legal here. We got deception here, deception here. So there's no doubt in my mind. This is a deception. What else? The deception ended and you regretted this, whatever this means. You could have had regrets about a new beginning that you juggled. <laughs> yeah. Looking at that, let me just say, you got a new beginning and you offered to become single from a commitment. You made a deceitful choice to wait on your ships to come in from a victory, legal deception, but it ended and now you're disappointed that a new beginning was juggled. Maybe because you were emotional and holding on to tightly or were greedy and there was a tower moment because you were creative about walking away because of this money, but you were a fast talker about being defensive and soul searching about some sort of commitment. All right. So the other thing that I see here, um, let me see this. Because of a new beginning, you legally juggled a deception. You were deceived about a new beginning choice, so you ended the offer and waited on your ships to come in. You were disappointed you became single because of a victory belief system. I don't know what that means. Honestly, all I'm seeing here is some of you, I, I almost, I'm going to tell you a couple of things I see. Some of you made it look like you were going to be left out in the cold, but you had already made a commitment to somebody and you knew you would be taken care of. But to antagonize, you chose to wait and to make sure that a new beginning was juggled because you were emotional and holding on too tightly or because you were emotional because you had been greedy. I also see when I 
pull these out. I can also see that you offered to become single. You chose to wait on your ships to come in from a deception. Um, but because it ended, you're juggling and you're emotional. Whatever that means. Yeah, I don't know. That's basically what I have for you. It's just kind of a feeling of, again, like the the Oracle card was talk. Oracle cards were talking about how you were trying to recover empathy by not telling the truth. And I'm whatever this is, this is a situation where you were provided for, but you chose to wait. So it would look like. Um, you'd been deceived or something like that. Yeah. Also, for some of you, it could be that somebody may have... Um, offered you a commitment, but you juggled it because you had offered to wait on your ships to come in, whatever that means. All right, guys, we're going to let that go. You'll know what this is if this is your reading. Um, we have Virgo, Taurus, Cancer, Libra, Scorpio, and Sagittarius all in this reading. But yeah, you would know what this is because there was a tower moment to it. Please make sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe. If you'd like to leave a donation, there will be a link in the description box below. Also, again, don't forget to check out Apocalyptic Tarot, which is the channel I will be going to once it begins to monetize. Thank you guys so much for your support, and I'll see you again soon. Bye.